hello again to the next video uh, to the red book series we will talk about the attack on weather top which is chapter 5 in chapter 5 you will earn 75 gems a melon leaf which you can give arvin or legolas uh, on and you can get 100 respect points there for them and you get the Kerrison Gold code, which gives you focus and army HP melee. As you can see, I did send my units to do stuff. And we got two things here. We will also get a coin, uh, we will also get resources, I'm sorry. And we'll make that part as fast as possible. You can see there's only one way we have to walk, so we just can start walking. We will take a look at the armies. We got four different armies. Mm, we got one with big units. Maybe we should take care of that here. We attack them because they are just small beasts and we should win easy against them. We did. So we march on. And we march on. It's not... yeah. It's, it's very easy, red book, very easy. Uh, now we got against rangers, they got bullseye, they do prioritize ranged units. That means we will use an army which has no ranged units at all. We are lucky that we got an army like that. Um, we will click on notification here just because we can. And we will take a look at the next tiles, so we do not waste time while we wait. Here are Hobbit Slingers, which means we should take a look about how to beat them. Cavalry and Bowmen. Okay, and so there we see we lost. That's not pretty un pretty fortunate. Um, how bad was it? Oh. We did not kill very much of the units, so we will send this one, because this army does also not have ranged units. Um, sometimes you will use armies, it's just like that, you can't change it. But it's not a problem at all, because for now we are just doing explaining here. And you can learn a lot if you keep paying attention. As you should see, we got this one, now we will use this army just to march. March and march. We can click on the notifications. We will march again, and we will march the last one, and then we will take a look at our armies. Maybe we got something that is strong against archers. So, we got this one. Armor break, which means we can reduce the damage of one target. Starker would do more damage, and they would they would we we will take this army most likely. Okay, against mounted units, they do not get mounted units. They against mini units, they are strong against melee units. So we will use this army because we got this one, which will lead to one hit an enemy target, which will lower their defenses. And they just got one unit here, because they just they, they only go for hobbits. And that means we will want we want to use that here so we can beat the hobbits very easy. Um, well because they will get the damage reduction. Uh, the, the, I'm sorry, the armor reduction. I'm very sorry. Less defense so now we move on and we got here so we will use this army because they are strong against cavalry and they are strong against melee units and they got one melee unit and two long distance units so we will start with kamul i'm not sure if i pronounce it correctly but if i I'm sorry if I didn't. So we'll see. This will not work out at all. As we can see here, we lost. 
So now we will use this one. No, 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 no. We will use this one because this one is strong against archers. There should be a lot of archers left. And we can switch to this one right now because then we should have. Oh, or we just do it. That's the first stage we get cleared. Now we will go to the second stage. As you can see, resources again. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. So, let's see. We got one, two, three armies. Three armies. Got one time with the hobbits. We got the bowmen. Mm -hmm. And we got the horsemen. We got. They are strong against melee, they are strong against mounted, and they are strong against range, uh, uh, against ranged units. So let's take a look. They got melee units. Mm, melee, melee. We got two. Uh, no, that was not very clever. We got, well, we got melee riders, so it should be fine. Now we can march on. Let's take a look here. Okay, we'll need to beat that one too. Which we're using, keep using them. It might fail here, I'm not sure about that. Oh, actually it was enough. So, now we can choose between the path here, which would lead to this one, uh, where we would fight archers and cave trolls, or this one, where we sh would fight pikemen and Marauders. Marauders? Nah, that, that's a little bit shitty to be honest, because I can't read it. But we will go for this one here, because we got pikemen too. As you can see here, we do also do bonus damage against horses, and there are horses, so we will try with this army to beat them here. We to fail, which is unfortunate, but there's only 166 horses left, which is fine. So we can just send this army in. We do not need to look out for them. But yeah, that's our tier 1 units only, so there is nothing to do for us right now. Now we just move. We do not need to clear everything, so we can let out this part here. And we will just march to the Witch King. So we try to use this army against the Witch King. Maybe we get lucky, or maybe we get lucky, and then we maybe will beat him and the stage will be over. We failed, so we have to use the Hobbits. Let's take a look at the battle report. Mm, well, we did a lot of damage, but it was just not enough, which is fine. We can spend, well, I can think about worse things to spend my time than talking to you guys. Last fight for today, or for this video at least, Mary and Pippin, they will kill them easily. We lose 400 Hobbit Slingers, but that's it. Stage cleared. And that's it for today's videos. The attack on Rider Top done. That was chapter 5, I think. Let's take a look. Attack on Rider Top, chapter 5 done. Let's see each other again soon for chapter 6.